Hey there, everyone. Sorry about the lengthy hiatus. I had some other stuff going on. I was sick. All that stuff I had going on. Wouldn't worry about it saying that the file was corrupted. Obviously, it's not. We will press on from exactly where we left off. Just finishing off Jasmine. Pretty much soloing her with my kick-ass Nido Queen Pyramid. In fact, it wasn't even pretty much. She just kicked ass. Anywho, uh, I've got everybody but my Cloister leveled up at this point, up to 30. Cloister is the only one that needs to be leveled up to 30. But in the meantime, I'm going to stop off and heal. If you recall, the last thing we saw uh, before I uh, ended the video, or one of the last things, was the Safari Zone getting opened up. And so I need to... Uh, kind of get out there and do that thing. So, I, uh, one thing is, I don't remember how to get there. So, let me just have a look-see here at my uh, key items. Um, oh wait, town map is on the Pokegear. So, let's see here. Uh, so it's west of Kyanwood. Okay. So let's fly over there then. What was the other thing on there? Oh yeah, I spotted Entei, so now I know where he is. That's cool, I guess. I have uh, no need to do anything with him, but uh, you know how it is. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to move uh, Shingle out in front of the party again. So that I can uh, train him up. But it's first off, let's go ahead and fly to Kyanwood. I apologize for my voice being a little bit rough. My new job basically has me talking on the phone all day, every day. So I uh, honestly don't know how realistic it is that uh, I'll keep doing these videos on weekdays. But I felt like I really did need to get one out. Which is why I'm going ahead and recording this one today. But anyway, I believe there are a couple of spot for, spots for catches out here on these routes as well. So let's uh, start making our way over to the Safari Zone. Okay, good, a hiker. I can probably fight him. Let's uh, have my cloister have some fun here. Longing for others is what it is. Battles are battles, so let's go. Okay, let's go, hyper guy. hiker guy. What sort of things do you have? Level 19 Dunsparce. Okay, this is my scared face. Put it to sleep. Well, or, you know, confuse it. Good job. Oh, speaking of put to sleep. Let's go ahead and just get you out of there before you get put to sleep. I'll uh, swap out to Puppy because Puppy is not afraid of level 19 Dunsparces. At all. Um, I just want to attack it. And one more wing attack should knock it out, but I don't feel like having to deal with you going to sleep, so I'll just put Shingle back in there. Uh, Surf should take care of this Dunsparce. I'm thinking. Am I right? I am right. Hey, and nobody's asleep. <laughs> He's got another one? What's this guy packing Dunsparces for? I mean, really. They're okay, I guess. I mean, not something I'd use, I don't think. But, well, to each their own, right? And there's hundreds and hundreds of Pokemon. Use whichever you want to use, I guess. Of course, the little jerk did paralyze Shingle, so that particular fight took a little bit longer than it needed to. And, of course, he's got a third one. Okay. I thought I'd have some nice, easy, like, Geodudes and Onyxes to knock out. Thanks, game. That's awkward. It's making me waste... A lot more surfs and stuff than I wanted to. Jerk. It's taking longer than I expected it to to take care of these Dunsparces. Ouch. Okay, good you knocked it out there. Didn't know that thing had rollout. Anyway, knocked out Hiker Devin. Good work, Shingle. Okay, let's go ahead and de-paralyze you, because this is not going to be your last fight on this one. Paralyze you. Fixed. There we go. 
All right, so pressing on, we got a cave here. Um, I'll avoid that for now and see if there's other ways to go. Because I don't really need more cave Pokemon. I could use more Pokemon to find in the grass. I'm not good with large crowds, so I'm camping out here with my Pokemon. Aren't you the same way? Well, I'm not camping. What do you got? A skip loom. Well, grass flying. I think I can risk a turn to ice beam you out of the way. And I can. Good night. Shingle's fast. Good work, Shingle. And a Meryl. Well, can't really do anything with you, Meryl. Let's get headlights some action. Y'all haven't really seen him in action yet since uh, I did the whole grinding off camera thing. Oh, uh, uh, excuse me. I'm pretty psyched about Stantler's move set so far. Headbutt and stomp are a couple of, or headbutt and takedown are a couple of good normal moves, but he's also got confusory and hypnosis. That's awesome. That's a, so much fun can be had with that. Hey, thanks for the useless item game. Okay. All right, so it looks like we're going to have to go in the cave next anyway. I don't really want to do that. Do I have any repels on me at the moment? I would like to skip having to run into stuff. I don't, but you know what? I'm actually going to go buy some. Be back in a second. Okay, and I'm back. Burying a bunch of super repels, because super repels are the best value. And it's time to go exploring. Let's see what we got in this cave. A dude. What's up, dude? See a fork in the road inside a cave. Most likely one way is right and the other leads to a dead end. People can't help trying both. I go up the ladder or go down the ladder? Um, down. So where's it go? Out here on Route 47. I guess that uh, did prove to be handy, that rappel. Even if I don't really need it for the cave, as it turns out. Well, let's roll around down here, see if I can find some items or something. Okay, nothing over there. Let's head back the other way. Oh, crud. Repel didn't even knock that out. And I don't have a tentacle. Oh, yeah, that's right. He gets the highest level guy in the party. Okay, well, tentacle would be a pretty handy backup in case something happens to Shingle. So let's go ahead and uh, put in our... Enemy weakener for catching her guy in Puppy. Puppy with good defenses now that he's a Caesar. A false swipe all day, every day. And it's good to do one more, because why not? Alright, it's at one health. And I think I've got. Do I have any dive balls? I don't. Well, lure ball for fishing. Um. Eh, friend ball. Should be fine. It's at one health. Max chance. Yep, that's what I'm talking about. Good work, puppy. That's how it's done. Okay, our new tentacle needs a name. Hold on, let me get our uh, website open. Okay, I confess I made a slight oopsie here. I totally forgot that... Uh, I Well, I, I messed up, but I accidentally forgot to start recording the video I will let you guys know what you missed um I caught a tentacle its name his name is guarantee I caught him here on route 47 my bad guys I did not I thought I hit the record button and I didn't and now I'm even madder because if I lied and said nothing then I would have could have gotten a star you so um, I'm uh I'm, I'm upset about that because a star you would have been freaking awesome. Didn't even know you could run into him here. Anyway, um, what I'm going to do now is uh, move Fedora out from in front. Or move Fedora out front so that the rappel I used actually works. And I'll continue exploring down here for items and stuff. I went over to the right and there was nothing over there. That's where I caught the tentacle. There's a path over there. Is there an item up here? Wait, I know what's out here. It's a waterfall I can't go up. I don't have the waterfall uh, HM yet. So, I guess we'll go over here and, uh, what, is there nothing here? Ha! Is it the exact spot I hit A? A pearl. Nice. That's worth some cash. Alright, surfing time. Go, go, gadget cluster. 
so are there any other two neat things? Okay, so nothing else out here. I'm a little bit bummed because I thought um, I'm a little bit. I'm glad at least that I didn't get stuck with a tentacle on Route 48 because I think that's our last chance at a Vulpix before we are done here, and I would very much like to get one of those. Um, haven't had a fire type in uh, some time. It would be nice to have one, especially one as awesome as a Nine Tails. But uh, I'll be saving that one for a little bit, you know, in case I uh, run into one a little ways on. So yeah, Cliff Cave, pop out. Got a double battle against a couple of Ace Trainers or Dragon Tamers or something like that. It's a double battle. Let's make sure we got a good team out there. Fedora Smoke, that should be fine. Let's have some fun. One plus one is two, but the two of us together is much stronger. The two of us aren't just some boring pair. Oh yeah, you have like the same same clothing. You're boring. Oh, okay, Electabuzz and Magmar. Well, I'm going to swap both of you out. <laughs> this is not a good matchup whatsoever. Uh, let's swap. Fed okay, Fedora's going to get hit by a fire attack. <coughs> I would put in shingle to absorb that, but that's probably not good. I'll, I'll switch out to Headlight for Fedora. And then for Smoke, who's probably going to get hit by Electric Attack, we will swap out for Pyramid. That's probably the best way to do it. There. Dealt with. And that Intimidate is nice. Headlight is best. Oh, and nice. Protect. Waste your time. Thunderbolt doesn't affect Pyramid. Okay. I handled that pretty much perfectly. That's pretty awesome. Okay, let's take these guys out one at a time. Magmar, I don't want out there at all. Let's make him go away. A Thunderbolt. Yeah, it didn't do much. A Headbutt's going to be a little bit better. Oh, Headlight, you are best. Down goes the Magmar. Uh, Thunder Wave's going to paralyze Headlight. That's okay. We're still in okay shape. Headbutt the Electabuzz, and Flamethrower the Electabuzz. That's what I'm talking about. Burn it! Not a ton of damage, but that's okay. Headbutt will do plenty. Headlight, headbutt. Best move. Alright, so that, that could have been frightening, but we handled it pretty darn well, I'm happy to say. Mom bought some stuff, I think. Thanks, Mom. What else we got here? Uh... Okay, looks like we're under the next small area up here. Um, there's an item over here. Let's grab that. What you got for me? Lagging tail. Oh, yeah, it makes you slow. Uh, I guess I could think of a, a situation where that would be handy, but I'm not particularly interested. Okay, here comes another double battle. Looks like, uh, not sure who. Oh, wait. Are we going to battle or what? Oh, okay. <laughs> Watching over my girlfriend makes my heart sore. My heart's feelings for my boyfriend are as wide and deep as the ocean. Wow. You two are adorable. <laughs> onyx and cloister. Fedora laughs at your onyx and your cloister. Uh, magical leaf that cloister. We don't want it ice beaming smoke. And just for good measure, try putting it to sleep too. Okay, problem solved. <laughs> no more cloister. Whoosh! That's probably enough to kill it, but I really wanted to play it safe on that. Uh, so we got the Onyx left. Sandstorm. Meh. This is my meh face. I also want to mention, guys, that I'm probably not going to record a particularly long video this time. And that's because, uh, like I said, I'm trying to save my voice a little bit. So more than likely, I'll probably end the video when I get to the Safari Zone. Even if it's, you know, before 30 minutes. Because my voice, like I said, is, is, you know, it's not in great shape and continuous talking is probably not going to help it. Okay, Route 48. I'm pretty sure that this is our last chance for a Vulpix in Johto, anyway. Uh, honestly, I'm not even sure who I'd want to replace with a Vulpix in my party right now. But damn, I would like to have one. So uh, let's sort of hope for the best and... See if I can get one. Gloom. One thing I definitely do not need is another grass type. But it's Nuzlocke. 
and you just gotta get what you get so I'll full swipe it down and uh, toss me a ball I'll toss a love ball because it is opposite gender to puppy and we'll catch it and unless something really tragic happens she's probably not gonna get a lot of use it secretes a sticky drool like honey, although sweet. It smells too repulsive to get very close. So the nickname for our caught gloom is uh, random noun generator. Pike. Your name is Pike. So whether you guys think that's the um you know, carnivorous fish or the pole arm weapon, it is up to you to decide that. Alright, with that done, let's go ahead and uh Get back in the menu and toss us another repel because I'm a lazy ass and I don't want to have too much wild Pokemon to fight because I'm not grinding right now. I feel like I'm in a pretty good shape as far as levels are concerned. So let's just uh, walk around. I, I thought there might be an item down at the bottom there. Oh, and that's all it was? Well, that's kind of a jip. Um, let me just go ahead and show you guys the... Uh, tentacle that I caught um, in the Pokemon Center here and uh, we will sample the sights and sounds of the Safari Zone next time whenever that is like I said I wouldn't expect as many weekday videos although I'll try to bring them out on Saturdays and Sundays uh, when my voice has had a little bit of time to rest I will definitely do videos on those days and I'll put out short videos during the week if I'm feeling up to it, like today. Uh, let's go ahead and check out the Pokemon we caught. We caught ourselves a tentacle in the gloom today. So our tentacle is here, guarantee, like I said. It is naive. Naive is what? Plus speed minus special defense. Well, those are the high, both high stats for the tentacle, tentacle line anyway, so that's fine, I guess. I mean, it's fine. I mean, it's not a great big deal. Uh, and our Gloom, whose name is Pike, as you saw, is naughty by nature. Ha, ha, ha. Uh, up attack, lowered special defense. Well, that's pretty shitty. Uh, but uh, like I said, though, I'm, you know, glo this Gloom is seriously like at least second in line behind Desire of my grass types. So... In all likelihood, not going to see any action at all. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I mean, let's just hope that I, that particular comment doesn't come back to bite me in the ass. Uh, I'm hoping it doesn't. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this video, I think. I want to thank you guys for watching. Sorry about the long hiatus. You can hear the strain in my voice. This is the job that I have now. And it hurts my throat, and it means that I'm probably not going to put out many videos during the week. Uh, and if you were, if your job was to um, call people on the phone all day, you'd probably think the same thing that I do. But that said, thanks for watching the video, guys. If you liked it, hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you guys next time.